Now bones come in cremated, heated, partially heated, or non-heated varieties, as you can see here. And the quality category impacts the reliability of the date and the level of collagen that can be extracted, if at all. A bone that has not been heated is pretreated by extraction of collagen proteins. This is the most reliable type of bone material that can be dated for non-cremated bones. Bones that have undergone low temperature heating, so lower than about 600 degrees Celsius, usually show black, blue, or gray patches on the exterior surfaces or in the interior, indicating that all of the fats and proteins have not yet been burned away, and thus the structural carbonate has not been completely converted. Bones that have not been completely charred black all the way through like a piece of charcoal are not suitable for dating as bone. High temperature heating can be a useful event in the history of a bone sample. If it was hot enough to char the collagen, the carbon in the bone will be very stable, resistant to contamination, and readily removed by full treatments with acid and alkali, as would be applied to a charcoal sample. So it's just a slightly different process than if you have a non-heated bones.